Well, COVID-19 has taken a toll on business. Former Kuva Business Chamber President Lee Kwat Ali says that it has slowed enterprise somewhat. It's relatively very slow compared to, to the norm, you know. And that is something we expected because of the COVID and the lockdown. But one of the bigger issues facing some of the importers of food, especially foodstuff, is the availability of foreign exchange. We continue to have problem accessing foreign exchange to pay for goods. And we know that is a problem because of the closure of a lot of um, companies that are owning foreign exchange, which is the point least of Syria. Not necessary to affect any business in Cuba or in Lisa, but it affects any business throughout the country. The requirement of foreign exchange to do business, Mr. Ali says, brings into clear focus the need to change the way we practice. That emphasizes more now the point that we need to start to diversify and look at saving foreign exchange and owning foreign exchange and how we do business, especially along food stuff, the food import bill. We need to, to see how best we can. You know, and if you could save the foreign exchange from leaving your country, and you could, you know, all these things will count. Mr. Ali suggests agriculture as the first sector which could be used to make the changes needed to generate or save foreign exchange. He uses rice as an example. He says we produce some, but right now we're importing 100%. And we in a situation where I'm working closely with the government to reduce that now in terms of putting a new parboil rice mill facility in this, in this country. So we head in into that direction. We could produce 50% of the rice that we consume. I already started doing some work with the, with the rice farmers in terms of improving their yields. I already started bringing in their, their seed stock for them. We've been doing this over the last year and a half, two years. And we have seen an improvement in the yield per acre. The former chamber head says other products can be explored as well, such as producing provisions for export. He says our tomatoes are top class and could form the basis of a downstream industry, producing tomato ketchup and paste. All these things are, are what can expel an evolution of agriculture, he says, to help us save foreign exchange as well as earn it. <laughs>